Cristina, te amo, Cristina. In a shocking development on Thursday, a man was arrested in Argentina for pointing a gun at Vice President Cristina Kirchner. The incident was informed by Security Minister Anibal Fernandez. Argentine President Alberto Fernandez said that the gun was loaded with five bullets but failed to fire when triggered. Several television channels broadcast footage of the man aiming a gun at the Vice President's head from close range as she was getting out of the car that was taking her home in Buenos Aires. Fernandez said that the forensic police personnel would now analyze fingerprints to obtain more information. He went on to condemn the attack and said that the attempt on de Kirchner's life was one of the most serious incidents since the country returned to democracy in 1983. Police said that the gunman, who local media identified as a 35-year-old Brazilian man, has been taken into custody. They are attempting to establish a motive for the attack. Hundreds of activists have gathered since last week in front of the home of Kirchner, who is accused of fraudulently awarding public works contracts in her stronghold in Patagonia. Prosecutors have asked that the ex-president who ruled from 2007 to 2015 face 12 years in jail and a lifetime ban from politics. Kirchner is the Senate president and enjoys parliamentary immunity. Even if convicted, the verdict is expected at the end of the year. She would not go to prison unless her sentence was ratified by the country's Supreme Court or she loses her Senate seat at the next elections at the end of 2023. Subscribe to One India channel and never miss an update.